everyone, I am Rodon from Boys and Girls Hairstyles. Today I have Carlin with me. He, I've been cutting his hair since he was tiny, since he was a little, little boy. Mm -hmm. So actually I can't believe we haven't had you on here <laughs> before now, but it's, it's all good. Um, anyway, we are going to do a fun haircut. We're gonna do a number two. We're gonna bring it back into here. Uh, we're gonna leave the tail. We are gonna trim this up a little bit so it's not quite as long. But I wanted to show you his haircut because um, this is a haircut that a ton of guys want. So, okay, just take the number two. We're going to blend this side over here. So I just go to about, about right there. Yeah, so he is kind of... Well, he was my neighbor. They ended up moving. Yeah. <laughs> but he was just around the corner. So I've known them forever. They are the best. Okay, so I want want you guys um, to see what I'm doing. I'm coming from up here, and then I, I start to slant down into the back here. Okay, so before, if you need to, you can you know, draw it out with one of those washable markers or whatever you want to do to come in. Um, I obviously have kind of my line because we cut his hair like this last time. So if you're cutting it like that for the first time, you can, you know, use a marker or you can just part it off and make sure that the parts, you know, even before you start doing the clippers. Gosh, that was long, wasn't it, Carlin? Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, they've been coming to get their hair cut since they were tiny. It was fun. I, His sister, remember, she would call me Badonna. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go to Badonna's house and get my hair cut. <laughs> Good memories. Okay, so after I get that done, he goes this way which I'll show you in a minute, but, okay, and you just want the same off the top? Mm -hmm. Just not, okay. So we take about that much off the top, a quarter to a half of an inch. So I just, I start up here in this crown area Okay, then I, I come down this middle. Now, if you're, if you're just starting, you know, to cut your hair like this, you obviously don't need to come and trim the back. You might only see a little bit of definition for the first time that you cut it. And then, of course, each time you cut it, you know, it'll show up more. But if not, you can come back. I'm just taking, you know, a quarter of an inch off of this just so it's not too bulky back here when we cut the side so short. Okay, and then on this side, you can see I kind of come from the shorter and come out this way. Okay, now this side, same thing, just holding that out. have work today? I don't today. Oh, nice. Yeah. That's a good day. <laughs> yeah, gotta do school instead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> true, true. Okay, now I'm going to take some of this length off a little bit. Just because, like I said, you don't want it too, too long. And then, of course, it, it depends on the look that you want. If you want it to look super long, then leave it longer. Okay, so I'm going to hold this out so you can see where this short is. I'm going to hold this out and I'm going to connect this with that bottom length just to take that little bit of a corner off. Okay, same with over here. I'm going to hold that this way. Just go down to the bottom. 
Okay, sweet. So now we're gonna come back up here and go with the length on the top. How's school going? Pretty good. Good. I'm definitely ready for it to be over, but. <laughs> right, I'm sure, I'm sure. <laughs> So my pattern um, is I go from the top to the right and then to the left. Okay, then I come to middle, then I go to the right and you can see where I've cut before, that's my guide point. And to the left. Okay, then to double check, I just come through the middle and you can come up this way. If there's any little pieces out, you know, that are longer, then you just obviously cut them a little bit shorter. Okay, then I'm gonna hold this down. Just trim up that front. Okay, now I'm gonna come up through this part. My poor um, comb <laughs> broke, so anyway, need another one. But I would do a fine, like a, a tight comb and come in here and kind of hold out. You don't wanna keep it in towards the header, it's gonna go really short, so you need to come in and hold it back out a little bit. Okay, and then you can go along this way. Come down into here. Just so it blends good. Okay. Then as soon as you feel like that's blended, and you can obviously double check um, and keep blending more if you feel like you need to. But again, you just come up from the sides, go in and then pull the, the comb back out. Then I just blend kind of halfway down and then just let that fall. Okay, then of course, another way that I check it is obviously looking in the mirror and make sure that the sides are good here, which I can see those are fine. And I'm just gonna kind of turn him and see how the blending is going. Still looks a little bit heavy through this area. So I'm just gonna blend that a tiny bit more. Okay, then another way I wanna show you guys is if there's any parts that you're having a hard time blending, you can take the, the texturizing shears and come through those areas and just texturize it a little bit.
And that will blend it a little better. Okay, same thing through this area. Okay, then the little trimmers. I obviously lift this up. I just come straight across and take this off. And the other thing I'm gonna do is just, I'm gonna show you guys. If you have any calyx on these sides um, and there's longer hairs, you can't get them, you know, with the clippers, when you use the clippers, you can just bring in the comb and the clippers like that and just take that shorter through that area. Okay, then we're just gonna go around his ear. Just like to comb around there, make sure all the little hairs are down. Okay, come up this way. Just turn my little trimmers on the side. Okay. All right, now, I'm just going to wet this a little tiny bit. And then this Flexi um, whole gel is unbelievable. It's so, so good. Um, this gel will hold, but it's not gonna be sticky. Um, so it makes your hair really soft, but it holds it in the style. This is good to put in, um, later if you would rather have a dry look that's kind of up and just over more dry look, uh, there's another product that works really good for that. Okay, now I gotta just show you his cute curls. Cause guys with curls, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> kind of like the, you know, they always have the long eyelashes and all that. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna turn him around so you can see that. Okay, handsome fella. Okay, thanks Carlin for letting us do this. You guys have a great day. Uh, if you're not on my email list, go ahead and sign up. I would love to chat that way. So have a good day, you guys. See ya.